Bitch, I don't need you to go to space. Hey guys, it's Mary B bringing you the mayhem and Oil of Olay has decided to go the route of Gillette to go completely woke with their new advertisement. And so I thought I would go ahead and give you guys a little look here and see what we're talking about. So I'm, I'm a little frustrated. I'm a little ticked off. I'm a little annoyed at the nonsense that they're spouting within this commercial. But let's take a look. We're going to go through this together, guys. So let me go ahead and pull this up here for you. It is it is nonsense, and I'll, and I'll break it down for you why that is. But we're gonna and we're gonna have to skip through this kind of slowly, guys. I'm a little worried about a copyright claim here, so we're gonna see exactly what happens. We're gonna go through this a little bit slowly here and see. Check this out. Is there enough space in space for women? What? Is there enough space in space for women? What? A, what a ridiculous question to ask. Hold on. Hold on. Is there enough space in space for women? Who wrote that? Are people really still asking that question? My sentiments exactly. Who wrote that? You think that by throwing it in there that you acknowledge the fact that that's completely and utterly, utterly ridiculous? Who wrote that? Who, who even, why are people still asking that question? They're not. They're not answer, asking that question. That is a ridiculous question, and no one thinks for two seconds that there's not enough space in space for women. That is ridiculous, and we're, we're, we're going to talk about why here in just a second. But let's go ahead and continue watching this nonsense. Operation Make Space for Women is ready for liftoff. I see what you did there. Make space for women, right? Because we got to leave a little room for girls. So let's put a little play on word here, on words here, right? Like it's it's not enough that you're pushing, you're pushing the equity thing, right? Like now we got to go into space too. We're getting super, super wokey woke up in this mug. So leave a little space in space for women. Never mind that you're really late to this game, Oil of Olay. You're really late to this game because women have been in space for a good long time now. So let's, just, it's supposed to be funny. It's just... Mission Control. Taraji B. Anthony. We have the opposite of a problem. Thank you. We do. We have exactly that. The opposite of a problem here. Women have done nothing but progress, but move forward, but have the advantage in so many different fields all of the time. We have the opposite of a problem as females. We're not excluded, we're not kept out, and if anything, we're bolstered and pushed forward to do more on a constant and regular basis. We have the absolute opposite of a problem as females. So can we stop acting like there's an issue here? There is so much space up here. Well, I could have told you that. Oh, look at that. Nicole Stott. That's a real life astronaut. You have an, a female astronaut in your commercial. You literally have one of those. Why are you pushing this? Why are you acting like this is a thing? Like women aren't in space, like women aren't pursuing these careers, like women aren't capable of handling this stuff for themselves. You literally have one right there in front of you, on the screen, in front of all of us. What are you, what are you pushing right now? When we make space for women, we make space for everyone. Oh, one, guys, 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 feminism. But feminism just means equality, right? It just means equality. That's all it means. It's about, it's about, you know, making sure that women have the same opportunities as men. We've had that for a really, really long time. When we make space for women, we make space for everyone. No, you're being woke here. You've gone uber duber woke and you want everyone to know just how special you are. You want to get up on your, your podium, your little platform of unearned moral superiority and all the while using women as some basis for making yourself feel righteous, right? You're using women for that. Tweet equals one dollar to girls who code. Oh, look at that. A, tw a tweet. And we'll put a dollar 
towards women going into coding. We are going to help girls out. If you talk about us, please give us all of that free advertisement because we're so righteous. We're so special. We're so wonderful. We're going to give a dollar to every girl for every time that you tweet in order to get her into coding. Like, let's push girls into this career. Never mind whether or not, never mind whether or not this is something that they would pursue individually for themselves, right? Like, we're just going to push this equity thing. Well, I'm sorry. I don't believe in equity. I believe in equality. I believe in people being able to choose to do whatever they want. And this unearned moral superiority thing is really frustrating. What does this button do? Eject. No! Yeah, yeah. All right. So Ole, Ole, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to be uh, not going to be tweeting about you, not going to be talking about you, not going to be giving you the attention that you're seeking here. And here's why, because I don't like being used. I don't like you taking women and using them as an opportunity to promote yourself. OK, I don't appreciate it. I don't like feeling like some kind of a freak show. Oh, look, it's the woman that's in space. Oh, look, it's women who code. I don't want to be I don't want it to be pointed out like that. These kinds of things move forward. They progress on their own naturally. And I didn't need your help. You got here really late. OK, you didn't get us here, Olay. Women got themselves to a place of equality where they can do whatever they want, whenever they want, however they want. We got ourselves there. We didn't need your help. And I don't appreciate you using us as some kind of a platform to bolster your own virtue signaling. It's very frustrating as a female. And it's condescending as if I needed you to get there. I need oil of Olay to get me to a place where I could go to space if I feel like it. Well, mm, women have been doing that for a while. Turns out, Turns out that for about the past 10 years or so, uh, basically half of the graduating class at NASA has been women. We did that without you. We didn't need you for that. So uh, thanks, but no thanks. I'll handle this on my own. Thank you very much. So anyway, guys, just wanted to share this with you and let you know. Uh, so Oil of LA has decided to go the route of Gillette. Go woke, go broke, because I'm not supporting this crap. So anyway, guys, do me a favor. Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. Let me know what you think about Oil of LA, Oil of LA. Laying it on really thick for everybody. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And I will talk to you later. Love, love. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and be sure to hit that bell for notifications so you can know when I put out new content. Thanks so much for watching guys and I'll see you around.